Sunday. It's been a hot minute since we started a vlog, a video diary. On Sunday, I'm up bright and early. I've been up since 6 a.m. I woke up, took a shower, and it took me, it takes me forever to get ready. So I was like, I really want to be on time to church today. So I was like, I'm gonna wake up at 6 a.m. So I got up at 6, took a shower did everything that I had to do and I ended up being ready early so I'm going ahead on my own you might be wondering where Fletcher is Fletcher's like I'm not leaving out this early so I was like cool I'm gonna go out on my own get the tithe because I just really want to be on time today okay so I usually stay until the PNC says like it moves on to the next person but 20 40 60 let me just tell you guys we're tithing $98, but this is like the tithe accumulated over the last two weeks because we didn't go to church. It's nine o'clock, so I think the library is open now. I'm gonna go ahead and put this moolah in my bra and take you off my car dashboard. Just kidding, I forgot to check the hours and the library is closed on Sundays. Fletcher's in the vehicle with us now. I got my ice cubes. I love eating ice. It's my favorite type of water. So it's her favorite type of snack, which is really good, <laughs> healthy. It's very healthy. We arrived at the time I wanted to arrive. 9.15, 15 minutes until the service starts. So I'm gonna finish my ice cubes and then we'll be good to go. Okay, so it's like around 5, 6 p.m. Somewhere in between there. I'm just getting up from a nap because after, when me and Fletcher were in church, something amazing happened and Fletcher was able to get a job at Amazon. So he's gonna be working there part-time overnight and we're flipping our sleep schedule. So I'm gonna get up in a little bit and then we're pulling a all nighter and we're staying up to what time, Fletch? 9 a.m. We'll lay down at 8 a.m. and we we'll sleep by 9. Yeah. And then we're gonna repeat. We're gonna sleep from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So from now on, I'll be up in the night hours and asleep during the day. But guess what, Fletcher got me? And Dr. Pepper! How'd you get it? CVS. With this CVS box we got for free? Yes. It just started crashing. Okay. We're at 9.99 9 subscribers. So let's sit here. Wait, where is the... You know what I'm talking about? Where you can uh, like... Analytic. Yes, see live count. This might take a while. And by a while, I mean a while. OMG, OMG. We're at 9,000. Okay, y'all, it's 1.15. I spent a lot of time talking on the phone. And now it's time to get into the shorts. Hold on, it's dark, I know. Just wait one second. Boom! Lighting's good. We're about to take, we're about to make some shorts because my next, my last short that I had scheduled comes out at 1.30 a.m. So I need to make 16 more! So in order for this to work, I need like the lighting to be kind of behind my phone but the way that i have my desk set up right now i don't know if i can fit all three of these tripods on the desk oh wait oh <laughs> wait i did i'm gonna eat a snack i'm gonna eat a can of mangoes and after that i don't know what else will be a snack because we're running out of food
just finished making all them shorts. Oh, I made 16 shorts. I don't know why it took me so long. Yeah, I literally started making shorts like two hours ago. It's 3.47 now. Oh, staying up until 9 a.m. This feels wrong. Oh, it's now 6.33 in the morning. I've been editing. I finished editing the video diaries. I'm starving. I don't know. Should I be eating right now? I'm still eating these mango. Let me go look at my schedule thing. You can come with me. Oh, I'm knocking stuff over. Ooh. Okay, look. Let's go look at my little schedule thing. I made a schedule so I can understand when I should be eating and stuff. So, it is currently, what did I say, like 6 a.m.? I forget what time I said it was. I think, oh yeah, I'm supposed to be eating a snack right now. And then a snack, and then laying down for bed at 8 a.m. Honestly, that's probably what I'm about to do. I'm probably about to just shower, maybe play. I mean, I would play Sims, but I just don't have it. I just don't have it in me. I'm so tired. So maybe I'll shower or like clean up the house a little bit and then shower and then lay down for bed and go to sleep at like 8 a.m. So it's like 7.41 p.m. I woke up around, so I went to sleep at like 9 a.m. And then I woke up around like 1 p.m. Then I forced myself to go back to sleep. Cause I was like, we're not supposed to get up until five. And then I woke up again like 2 p.m. and I just kept waking up. I mean, that happens to me in the nighttime also. I lay, it's like my body only wants me to sleep like two to four hours at a time. But yeah, I ended up getting on Sims, playing Sims for a little bit. Then I went and listened to FJ's heart rate. And I feel, I just feel a little concerned about his heart rate because it's normally in the 140s and now it's in the 120s like it's more like 115 to 125 on average instead of being in like the high 30s to mid 40s so i'm a little bit concerned but i have an appointment tomorrow morning at seven i usually like to shower when i wake up and i know on this flip schedule maybe it will be easier to shower at the end of my day which is in the morning so now i'm trying to shower like at 7 a.m 8 a.m or whatever. no 7 a.m because i really want to be in the bed at 8 a.m but considering that i'm not really sleeping like i haven't been sleeping much <sighs> okay we're back at my little desky desk and i've decided i'm gonna respond to comments but you're always be trying to put your password into my computer because i've been playing sims on your pet on your computer yeah. But anyways, I'm going to go onto YouTube and respond to as many comments as possible. This is my lunch. Shout out to my hubby. Not even, I'm not even going to lie, y'all. I'm feeling a little, a little overwhelmed. I spent the last, like, five hours responding to comments. And I'm going to keep up with them. I'm going to keep up with them this time. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> There's already comments coming in. I'm going to keep up with them this time. Hello, everybody. Um, it's like 3.30 in the morning. And we've been trying to stay up all night. Um, not stay up all night because we sleep from like 9 to 5. Because my shift, my new job starts at like 7. So I just took a nap because we kind of didn't sleep the full 8 hours. And I just did that like a couple hours ago, and um, Sadie is now, I don't know if you can see it, yeah, Sadie's now sleeping, and she'll wake up in like an hour and a half, yeah. Now to Golden Corral for giving us a free meal. Fletcher's birthday is tomorrow, yeah, so we got a lot of little free coupons and stuff, so we're about to eat good. Oh, man. This is my food. And this is Fletcher's food. <laughs> Fletcher and I are about to rewatch my favorite movie, Room. 
I love this movie. It's always a good cry. You should go watch it. <sighs> Guess what? It's actually morning today. It's currently 10.22 a.m. on Wednesday, July 31st, Fletcher's 20th birthday. And we have a lot to do today because honestly, I wanted to do this last night, but I was just so tired. Last night we watched Room. I fell asleep during that movie. So I fell asleep around like 3 a.m., which is way earlier than I was supposed to. I was supposed to stay up until 5 so that I could wake up around like 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1. So I could wake up around like 1, 2 o'clock. Well, 1 o'clock because I'm going um, with my cousin to take my goddaughter to the doctors. So I was like, okay, I actually need to go to bed a little earlier so I can wake up at a reasonable time so that I can go with her. But the problem was... I was sleepy, so I went to sleep. So now all the things that I was planning to do last night, I need to do today before I leave out to go to the doctor's with my goddaughter. I need to clean up because our house in shambles. And I feel like it's been in shambles all month. And I think that's why I've been having like struggling a lot mentally. It's not just like situations going on outside of me and Fletcher like there's just a lot going on socially right now and not just socially but like with just random things like with our sink I mean our sink is fine now they came and fixed it but like traumatizing and then like I was upset not too long ago the last time I did laundry because the washing machine kept flooding and the dryer wasn't drying the clothes so I made a complaint for them to fix it so I'm hoping that when I do laundry today that it's fixed because we are low on funds and then yeah that was also another stressor of us both being unemployed at the same time like who even would have thought that would have ever happened not me it did and even though Fletcher did get a job and he starts on the fifth because we went so much time unemployed there's gonna be like basically a what is it called when like every action has an equal and opposite reaction like a consequence you know because all the money that we were living off of before was for july now we're heading into august we have enough money, barely enough money to get through August. I mean, we have our bills, but I'm talking about like groceries and laundry and stuff like that. Like we're basically like making it tight, 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 tight. And then because the job the Fletcher was able to get was only a part-time job, it's gonna be even tighter for September. So I'm just kind of like, Ooh, thinking about the choices that I've made, thinking about the choices that Fletcher's made, and I'm like, ooh, if I could go back. I mean, it is what it is, but I don't know. I, I think about, I was thinking about this yesterday, because I chose my baby's health over money, because I couldn't be working right now, but I would've went to preterm labor. I would've went to preterm labor, or I would've had to go get my heart checked, because I was originally going to get my heart checked, because I kept getting, having heart palpitation. I would've ended up being, like, becoming high-risk pregnancy due to working. So, I ultimately chose the health of my baby over money, and I'm like, was that a bad decision? <laughs> I've had so many comments where people are like, get on government assistance, get food stamps, get WIC. Get this, get that, and I just don't want to. Okay, so like I was saying earlier, the apartment is a mess. Like, <sighs> I think I just need to go through every room and clean. And I'm gonna make a video of it. I just wanna do like a silent clean session. Okay, I have no idea where my AirPods are, so I guess. It's actually just going to be silent cleaning. How huh? I find them? I'm checking in this baby bag. Like it could always be in there. Oh, 
It was in the baby bag. Hey everybody, my name is Mercedes Neighbors and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are doing a clean with me. You know, I ended up having to spend $25 on that laundry. That's a ridiculous amount of money. <laughs> I can't wait until after it gets here. Look at this bassinet. We're running into Dollar Tree to get some things for the house. Fletcher has some gift cards, so he's grabbing some snacks. My favorite store, except, but now everything, they have $5 stuff, so it's not Dollar Tree anymore, so sad. Now we're in the process of getting gas. Let's see if we can see the cost. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, also, I had $3 in rewards here at Exxon, so I ended up putting $3 rewards on there, so. Yeah, yeah, my gas was only $20.04. After a long day of cleaning and enjoying Fletcher's birthday, I'm honestly exhausted and I think I'm gonna have to fail at our little uh, thing that we're doing where we try to stay up all night because I've been up since 7 a.m. cleaning the house. Fletcher was able to stay up a little later than me last night and he woke up later in the afternoon but even he didn't wake up, uh, he woke up around 12 p.m. That's you know way, what? that's five hours earlier than we were intending on waking up. And you know what? Uh-huh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass this mission today. I really think that uh, it's in both of our best interests to go to sleep, but Fletcher believes he can handle it. So we'll uh, come back to you tomorrow and see how he's feeling. Yeah, don't, don't ignore the bags under my eyes. Oh, and I didn't do nothing for YouTube today, but I'm not even mad at it. You know, I didn't make no shorts. I didn't edit any videos, but I didn't respond to any comments or make any community posts. But, I, you know what? One day of inconsistency on YouTube in order to get my house in order and celebrate my husband's birthday, I think I'm okay. I think I'm happy. What are you looking for, Fletcher? I know where it is. Where are you? They are um, in the TV stand. Remember when you bent them down? Oh, yeah. It's 8:25 a.m. on August 1st, so happy first of the month! And I just finished editing my clean with me video, and it's 10 minutes and five seconds long. I did that on purpose. I wanted it to be 10 minutes. I heard that like if you make a video 10 minutes long, like your like the minimum a video should be is 10 minutes long. It was an hour of footage, but I was like, I could not sit here and talk over a voice recording for an hour. So I chop it down. Well, I didn't chop it down. I made the entire video five times speed. <laughs> so it's still the full hour of footage. You're getting to see every part of my cleaning process but it's all in five times speed now i'm trying to think of what other videos to film i really did enjoy making this one like it was silent to film and then i did a voiceover and i'm like i want to make more videos where i do a voiceover okay i'm all dressed and ready to go i'm in i'm going to go with my family to visit my grandfather because it's my grandpa's birthday all right y'all we're going to the where are we going Fletch? we're going back to we're going to a buffet we're going to is that the same one that we usually do um the problem is that one might close a bit you. too early at nine which means we're gonna have to go to a different buffet oh that's awful Okay, I guess I'll be willing to try something new. I just came to say before I go to bed that that buffet was nasty. It was awful. It was a waste of money. It was terrible. Poor Fletcher wasted his money on his birthday. His birthday money, he wasted it. It was disgusting. It was the worst place I've ever been to. It's Friday. I came with my cousin to tour. 
an apartment. So we're just looking at an apartment. I like this place. And it's not even like that much more expensive than what we have. It makes me wanna upgrade. It's a two bedroom. So like when I do feel the need to upgrade to a two bedroom, like options like these are nice. This is nice. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. I like it. Maybe you will put your things over here. I know. When I'm ready to upgrade to a two bedroom. Yes. <laughs> Y'all. Um, so we. Of course, my camera stopped recording as soon as it stops. But okay, y'all, the light is not just off. It was been flickering for a good 30 seconds because it's pouring outside. So I was working on my YouTube stuff and I can't even do it because the internet is out. Like, look at that. I don't know if you can see the rain out there. It was lightning, thundering, everything. For some reason, my camera was tripping. Like, it wouldn't turn on that whole time. It's not even connected to Wi-Fi or anything. So I don't know why it was tripping like that. But as soon as it stopped flickering, all of a sudden I can, all of a sudden I can show y'all. Um, if it starts flickering again, I'm gonna turn the camera on so fast. Okay, y'all, so it is 6.52 p.m. at this point. We're about to head to Taco Bell because your girl's starving, actually starving. I've been eating cereal all day, and unfortunately, cereal is just not doing the job, and we can't cook anything because... <sighs> oh my gosh, I was like, why did Fletcher just turn the lights on? <laughs> I guess we can make the spaghetti. <laughs> I still want to go to talk. We going to Taco Bell. We was about to go to Taco Bell. We are going to Taco Bell. I still. mean, we're using your birthday money, so. That's what I'm saying. And I'm gonna. I was gonna drive to for my food. I was just gonna drive to Dairy Queen to get myself food. Hold on, I need to switch this to autofocus. Why did you hear me yell? Yes, I heard you yell. I was like, "What's going on?" I I don't know why it didn't click in my brain immediately that. The the <laughs> the lights came back on, yeah. And I was getting real frustrated because I've been trying to work on YouTube, but the power's been out. So we can go celebrate our lights coming back on with some Taco Bell. <laughs> yeah, I'm so ready to eat my tacos after the day that I've had. The day that I've had with the power being out and not being able to do anything productive. Today was gonna be my productive day. It really was. You still, and have, the, you still have a whole night. That's true. I still got a whole night. Today was going to be my productive day, though. And I was really in the zone. I was really in the zone. And the power went out, and my computer put out of that little dinosaur. And I just looked at it, and I was like, <sighs> So, struggle. One of the struggles of being a content creator. If your Wi Fi go out, <laughs> so does your career. <laughs> Look at my taco. I'm about to tear up my taco. And I had tacos yesterday too, but I didn't record it. But now I got another set of tacos. Thanks to Fletcher Neighbors, who keep buying me tacos with his gift card money. I got no money left. No more tacos for you. <laughs> Fletcher got some yummy Dairy Queen. And what's this drink you got? Coke. Coca-Cola. Can I have a chicken tender? No. There's only three. Oh, okay. I'll let you eat it. Say hi, Bob. Survivor want to eat a chicken tender. He only got three, Survivor. No. Say no. No. Say her no to her. No. Get down. No chicken for you. Oh, look at her sitting patiently. She wants your food. Oh. Mm -hmm. No for you. Okay, y'all, it's kind of dark in here. I feel like I haven't filmed much this week, but I did film, kind of. <laughs> Anyways, I'm about to go edit this video because it's 10.25 p.m., so that's, it's basic, Saturday's basically over. It's supposed to be Sunday. So I'll just start up the next one in the middle of the night. <laughs> but anyways, I just want to let you guys know before I go, that I scheduled to post. I have video diary coming out on the fourth. Vid uh, why I'll never get on government assistance coming out on the sixth. Clean with me coming out on the eighth. 
went to my hospital bag is scheduled for the 13th so me and Fletcher just gotta work on for the 10th I need a pregnancy update video and then I have to edit this video which will be posted on the 11th and then I need to make a video to post on the 15th so I'm gonna stick with my I'm sticking with my Sunday Tuesday Thursday Saturday schedule every all the videos being posted at 12 p.m. and yeah I think that's it for this video I will see you guys in next week's vlog so I'll see you guys on what the 18th <laughs> bye so I film everything all the highs and lows my mistakes and all my winnings I'm watching myself grow